Of the 60 animals on a certain farm, two-thirds are either pigs or cows. How many of the animals are cows? Statement 1. The farm has more than twice as many cows as it has pigs. Statement 2. The farm has more than 12 pigs. So let's start with the information that we're given in the question stem. Number one, two-thirds are either pigs or cows. So two-thirds of 60 is going to be 40 animals, pigs, or cows. So we want to know the exact number of cows. Statement one tells us the farm has more than twice as many cows as it has pigs. So that's going to be C is greater than 2P. But that's not enough to tell us how many cows there are. So that's insufficient. Statement two, the farm has more than 12 pigs. So we know P is greater than 12. That still tells us nothing about the number of cows. So that's insufficient. However, if we put the statements together, what we'll find is, let's start with the P. So our minimum value of P is going to be 13 because it has to be greater than 12, which means that our C min is gonna to have to be double that plus one. So that's 27. And notice that this conveniently gives us 40 exactly. This is probably the only set of values that actually works, but let's just test and see. So if we do P min is 14, for example, then that's gonna make C min twice as many plus one, so that's 29, which gives us 43. So that's certainly not going to work. So since our value of pigs and cows together has to be 40, we can see that this is actually the only group that works. And then we know that we have 27 cows total, and the answer is C. If you found this video useful, the best way to support the channel is to click like or subscribe on YouTube. And if you're interested, you can get a free 23-page Properties and Numbers guide. When you click on the link in the top right-hand corner, you'll get a link to that guide. And if you're having any trouble with those annoying Properties of Numbers questions, this is the guide for you. Some very GMAT-specific information involved. Thanks a lot for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.